think we'll do a short video of how to assemble this battery pack because it has little common sense involved in the design. Um, so this is an isolator, it needs to be enough for the UPS to work. Uh, hard to put that in one handed. Okay, um, and this is what connects to the UPS itself. Um, so I'll start from this. Um, we'll follow this red so it goes into the first battery, jumps to the second, third. And this is where the isolator fits in. So this battery sends a red wire to the isolator. And when it goes back, oh, sorry, it sends a black wire to the isolator. And when it goes back, it zigzags up here to this cell. And then continues down until it gets to the last cell, which is connected to this. So you could kind of ignore the isolator, or you could even put a link from here to here. It's best to have it in. And then the wiring goes from this battery all the way down there and across here and back to the connector. Um, now the case is symmetrically stamped, so the top's the same as the bottom. Um, both the cables come out the front, but sometimes people try and have a cable come out the back, that's wrong. Uh, there's a small protector sheath so that the uh, case, which is stamped frame, can't cut the cable. Um, I generally have one going through the bottom, one going through the top. Um, then if you do have a multimeter with the isolator and you can check that the voltage it should be over 75 so let's see probably 78 yeah 